Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has rejected Hamas's call for a ceasefire and pledged to continue Israel's military offensive in Gaza until achieving what he termed, quote, absolute victory. Despite concerns raised by humanitarian agencies about potential severe consequences, Netanyahu announced that he has instructed the Israel Defense Forces to prepare for an advance into the southern Gaza city of Rafah. Following a meeting with U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken, who has been working towards a ceasefire agreement during his regional travels, Netanyahu made these remarks. The United States has been urging Israel to adjust its tactics in Gaza due to the escalating number of casualties. Officials in the Hamas-controlled enclave claimed the death toll is nearing 28,000, with a significant number being women and children, CBS News reported. It's important to note that Hamas officials do not differentiate between combatants and civilians in their reported statistics. Quote, We are on the way to an absolute victory, Netanyahu said, adding that the IDF's operation in Gaza would last months, not years. Quote, There is no solution, the Israeli leader said.